Hi, I'm Alex Ineku, and this is Ekai's Musical Encyclopedia. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, please. Today's word is diaphragm. Diaphragm. And with my accent, I'm sure you're already laughing. I'm sorry, okay? I'm not a native English speaker. And this video actually uh, presents a bunch of, uh, of challenges for me, but I'll do it in English anyway. It's a free video. You don't care if I speak properly or not. Take it for its entertainment value as you observe as I suffer to explain what a diaphragm is in my second language, okay? So let's go. The diaphragm is a muscle membrane. Mm -hmm that serves to, to separate the lungs from the digestive part of your body, okay? So, think of your ribs, okay? Touch your ribs. Yes, excellent, very good. Your ribs are there to protect your lungs, okay? Your lungs are empty bags. They serve for nothing except for the diaphragm, which is in the bottom part of your lungs, separating lungs from lungs to um, the digestive part, as I said. And when you contract your diaphragm, it will create a vacuum inside the, the lungs and will pull the air inside your lungs. So observe. This is the diaphragm acting. It's not your lungs acting. Many people say, Oh, my, I'm expanding my lungs. You're not expanding your lungs. You are contracting your diaphragm so that it will provoke your, lung, your lungs to create a vacuum inside them and thus pulling the air inside. There you go. I'm suffering. I have an illustration here and it's written in, port Oops. It's written in Portuguese here. Diaphragma. And in English it's diaphragm. This is your diaphragm. But it's not yours, it's the draw. But anyway, um, this is the ribs, as, I, as I, these are the ribs, as I, as I pointed out, and the ribs uh, protect the lungs. The diaphragm is this membrane, uh, here uh, indicated in red, and it's funny because they, they took the diaphragm out of the body here, and you see it as a membrane. It looks like a, a helmet or something like that. Okay, it's just a membrane, but it's made of muscle. So, when you, you pull your diaphragm down by doing this, you create vacuum inside the lungs and the air comes in. It works very much like a syringe. Oh, there you go, another complex word in English. The syringe is, you know, everybody's vaccinated nowadays, correct? So you pull the, the I don't know how you call that black rubber part inside the syringe. Anyway, you, the syringe is made of two parts kind of a cup and then a, a baston, a bassinet, oh my god, English, which you, you insert inside the tube. So when you pull it, it will create a vacuum inside the syringe and it will bring the, the medicine or the vaccine or the blood, whether you're, you're, you're taking out blood, it will, when you pull the, the, the thing, it will bring whatever you want inside the syringe by creating a vacuum inside the syringe. You need to pull it so that the medicine will come in, so that the vaccine will come in. And then you push it out and the vaccine will come out of the syringe. The medicine will come out of the syringe. Okay, you understand what I'm saying? The diaphragm works exactly the same way, okay? Am I a brilliant teacher or what? Well, it's not my idea. My voice teacher, Zwinglio Faustini, here in Brasilia, Brazil, brought a syringe in the first class of vocal physiology. That's the name of the, the course that I was taking when I was 19 or something. And he showed us that, and I never forgot. It was very interesting. Part of that course was also going into a morgue to understand what a larynge was and that was complex. Anyway, today's word was diaphragm. Did you learn a little bit about it? Excellent. This is Ekai's Musical Encyclopedia. I'm Alex Ineco. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Sorry for my English.